There are few things greater than being able to take something old and make it new. Reusing something in your house is pretty extraordinary. In this video, you're gonna see me take a 30-year-old light fixture in the throne room of my master bathroom, hit it with some steel wool, pop some spray paint on there, and slap it back up on my ceiling. It looks amazing. If you haven't yet checked out the other videos from the master bathroom remodel, you can catch those here. Do me a favor and subscribe to this video. It helps out a lot. And pew, hammer that like button. I was painting the throne room, and while I was cutting in that red, the white over the red, I looked at this fixture and I was like oh my gosh so I figured instead of having to replace it why not take it down take the glass off of it clean off the half inch of dust and since I have an oil rubbed bronze motif throughout the place I might be able to get away with just spray painting it black putting the glass back on slap some LEDs in there it's gonna be on the top of the throne room you know what I mean like probably get away with it being black on the on the ceiling of the throne room so i washed it all off took it apart i'm hitting it with a little steel wool here because i'm like well you know if i can spray paint this save a little money so i'm just going to try to get rid of some of this top coat of rust and then i'll hit it with some of this rust-oleum two-in-one flat paint primer so i took out all the screws that hold the glass lampshades in those are already distressed brass to begin with or bronze ish and i'll put those back in the nut that holds this on is pretty dark i'll be all right with that those will give it a little bit of a two-tone look and i don't need to get this perfect i just have to scruff up the surface just a little bit so that paint holds I think that's pretty good. Well, that's still wool on there. So I'm gonna hit this with the air a little bit. Slap some paint on it. A little compressed air. Feeling pretty good about that. Cover up the terminals here. Now I don't need to worry about painting the inside because the glass lamp shades are gonna be in there. I do wanna get a little bit around in there, so. Shake this up, pull out that little plug there. I could have taken these cups off however the inside had a ton of wires just wrapped all three of them were wrapped up together in a big hornet's nest of wiring and that looks pretty good to me i'll let it dry flip it over touch it up well that dried pretty well i'm happy with that I'm look for some areas that i might have missed
think that when that dries, that's going to be it. The wires I was talking about inside it, I don't want to take those bowls off. So now I'm just going to pop this back on there the way it was. The paint's still wet up on the ceiling, so I'm going to get this done while I'm waiting. Nice and tight. Now that'll just hang there by it. Obviously, making sure we're off at the switch, otherwise, we would be lit up like a firecracker. And I'm going to let that hang until that paint is dry because I don't want to get any paint on the sides of my new black sheen and now i've got all my wires hooked up i've got my wire nights on tucked in this is dry now it's good so i'm just going to tuck this in find my center ply hole here carefully tuck that in there all the way up to the ceiling and then i'm just going to connect this back on tight to the ceiling looks pretty good i like how that's two-tone it's got this rough look to it but this looks really clean super clean let's put the glass fittings on so let me just get these started here well, that's not so bad tuck that in there and It's got that classic look to it, but now it's a little bit updated with some paint. We don't have that 80s brown up here with all that rust on it. Not that anybody's really looking at the ceiling when they're in the throne room, considering how old they are. They're 20 years old. Actually, 30 years old. This fixture was put in in 1990. So to have something that's 30 years old, slap a little bit of steel wool and some paint on it, have it looking like this. Cool. Thanks for checking out this video of the lighting fixture up top in the throne room. It was really cool to be able to just pull that thing down and say, I wonder if we can get this done. Hit it with some steel wool, nail it with some paint. It looks really good actually when it's up on the ceiling. I obviously didn't have all the light bulbs in it because I didn't want to blind the camera, but with that thing on, it's really illuminating with these LEDs. That old technology mixed with new lighting. Subscribe if you haven't already, hit that notification bell, and we'll see you next time here on Cool Hand Ryan.